Oh, the uncle? Why are we here? Remember when I said I'd help you get confidence? Well, this is how. How is a cave going to help? Well, a long time ago, there were these kids. These kids were inside of a cave. But they entered and they never came out. There was a rumor that a murderer killed them. That was 1,000 years ago, and ever since, people were afraid to go in this cave. Bianca, I don't think this is a good idea. Just get in. Oh! Whoa, what is this place? It's so shiny. Wait, Bianca, don't touch it! <laughs> Ugh, where are those two? What is taking them so long? Maybe they're sick! Or maybe they're making out! Stop being so gross! I bet they're going... Mm -hmm. How immature! Those two are driving me crazy! I'm crazy! Everyone, this is important! Finally, you're here! But where's Bianca? That's what this is about! Bianca is stuck inside of this glowing ball. What are you talking about? Well, we went inside of this cave. You don't mean the cave of death. I specifically told you not to go in there. I'm sorry. Quick, everyone, we need to check this out. What are these balls? Don't move. Wait, Ubo, maybe it's not safe to touch. <laughs> Oh no, did Ooh Ball touch the ball? Yeah, and she went inside of it. Another one bites the dust. More lore, there is a time and a place. What are we gonna do now? I have an idea. What do you mean you can't time travel right now? I meant exactly that. But you time traveled to save me. Well, my time travel has a little bit of a cork. You see, someone first has to die. Then I'm able to time travel back and save them. That's how my time travel works. And that's how I saved you. The shooting star first killed you. And then I went back in time and saved you. My watch alerts me when someone's in danger. Then it allows me to go back in time. But Bianca and Uwe Ball aren't dead. They're just trapped. Then let's just kill more lore. Then you could travel back in time. Wait, what? That wouldn't work. I can only travel back to the three minutes after the death. So Bianca and Ooh Ball are trapped forever? At least three minutes to the final eight. Two people just got trapped inside of a magic ball? And you're still thinking about this dumb game? Sorry, I just really want to win. So now what? Well, I'm not legally responsible for their kidnapping, so... You can't possibly suggest that we leave them trapped. Well, we have no way to save them. I'm sorry, but they're as good as dead. Well, not exactly. What do you mean? We can ask Portal to help us. Who's Portal? Remember, he was in Season 1, he got 19. I didn't watch Season 1. I couldn't be bothered. Well, what can Portal do? He's able to travel to different dimensions and stuff. And he's very knowledgeable. But isn't he busy traveling with Green Square? They're taking a break from that right now. Well then, where is he? He's in Malibu sign up for America's Got Talent. Ask the goddess of reality TV shows! I can travel to reality TV show locations! Great, then teleport us. I got the balls Bianca and Uwu Ball are in, so let's go. I can't wait to audition. I'm going to be a star. Huh? What's this? Hi, Portal. Remember me? Oh, hi, Color Green. How's it been? Oh, you know, the usual. I'm at a reality show. How about you? Oh, I've been practicing my object manipulation skills. And how has Green Square been going? She's a little nervous about her upcoming audition. 
Oh, by the way, how's- Can you stop with the family reunion already? Um, Portal, I'm Golden Pillow, the new host, and two of my contestants got trapped inside of these balls. Huh? What's going on? Bianca and Uba are trapped in these orbs. Do you know anything about these and how to open them? Hmm, <sighs> let me check my notes. I think I found it. It's the orb right here. This orb uses magic succulent energy to trap its victims. The only way to open it is by hurting the wielder of the orb. Wielder of the orb. We found the orb in the cave of death. So it's possible the wielder is the person who killed those kids. But the story is a thousand years old. There's no way that murderer is still alive. I don't think it's that murderer either. In the book, it says only star gods can wield the orb. Star gods? Are you talking about Astrius? No, Astrius is the god of stars, planets, and astronomy. Star gods, however, are like species like Starry. Starry? The god who took over planet Earth? Yes, him. But Starry is dead. Starry isn't the only one of his kind. To explain, let me tell you a story. I travel to many different dimensions and universes. And throughout my years, there's been a trend. I've encountered many star gods. I've seen all of them destroy the dimension they were in. And I realize after they destroy or take over the dimension, they send their children to a different dimension. And then their children destroys that dimension. And then the process repeats. I've seen this so many times. So I made it my job to stop these star gods. I fought those stars for 25,000 years. After that, I decided to take a break. So I joined season one of Battle for a Golden Pillow. And I brought color green and green square with me. And that's why a star god must be in possession of these orbs. Wait, so you're basically saying... Starry repopulated? That's right! You got the answer correct, class! Who said that? I did. It's me. The daughter of Starry. I'm Starita. Think fast. Ah! You guys have to stop Starina! Oh no! He's been captured! And he won't be the only one! <laughs>
you. <laughs>